Imagine you're on the field, about to score a touchdown, when suddenly a referee calls a penalty on your team. That's exactly what happened to the New England Patriots in Super Bowl 51, when they were inches away from winning their sixth title. The NFL is filled with such heart-stopping moments. In this video, we'll present 10 of the most insane NFL moments that will challenge your understanding of football. These are the plays that defied all logic, physics, and expectations, altering the course of history. Trust us, you don't want to miss this video, because we're going to unveil the secrets behind these incredible moments as well, and the last one is guaranteed to leave your jaw on the floor. So stay tuned to witness the unbelievable. On February 5th, 2017, a whopping 111 million people were glued to their screens watching the Atlanta Falcons go head-to-head -head against the New England Patriots. The Falcons were killing it, leading an impressive 28-3 at halftime. It looked like they had it in the bag with their incredible skills and game plan, but Tom Brady and the Patriots had other plans as they were quietly plotting a historic comeback. As the game wound down, it got intense. Then, in a jaw-dropping twist, the Patriots clinched an overtime win with James White's touchdown, sealing a 34-28 victory. It's one of those things that's hard to wrap your head around, but the Patriots are always known for making history. And you won't believe it, even today, the Falcons get teased about that 28-3 scoreline. That night was unforgettable, all thanks to Tom Brady and the team. Now, you might think that was unforgettable, but be ready for this ninth moment that is even more insane. In the 2000 playoffs, the Buffalo Bills and Titans were deadlocked in a 16-15 match, leaving the Titans with a mere 16 seconds. It was an intense moment as the Titans faced a significant challenge. Then came Lorenzo Neal's pass to Frank Wycheck, which changed everything. But Wycheck didn't just catch it and stop. He made an incredible long pass to Kevin Dyson that felt like lightning. Dyson ran down the field untouched and scored a breathtaking touchdown, securing the win for the team. And that's how the Titans snatched victory from the jaws of defeat in a historic 22-16 win. The play was debated, but it was legit, securing the Music City miracle as a stroke of pure, unbelievable brilliance. Coming to the eighth moment on our list, there's a tale of Super Bowl 52, where everyone had their money on the New England Patriots to seal the deal. They were on a spectacular 18-0 run, and nobody, like nobody, expected the New York Giants to pull off an upset, especially entering the Super Bowl as a wildcard team. But guess what? In the fourth quarter, when things were looking hard for the Giants trailing 14-10, something straight out of a storybook happened. Eli Manning tossed the ball to David Tyree right in the middle of the field. In a gravity-defying leap, Tyree, the hero of the night, made an insane catch, holding the ball against his helmet like it was glued there. This single play set the stage for a game-winning touchdown, sealing a stunning 17-14 victory for the Giants. It was a moment that shattered the Patriots' dream of an undefeated season. That catch Tyree made was so amazing, it was named the Play of the Decade 2000s by NFL Films. The atmosphere is heating up with these incredible moments, and this seventh one is a spark that ignites the fire. In the 2018 playoff showdown, the Minnesota Vikings dominated with a 17-0 lead against the New Orleans Saints. It felt like an unbeatable lead, especially with the Saints having just a few seconds left. But the Saints were all about surprises. They made a spectacular comeback, which tied the score at 23-23 in mere seconds. The hero behind this miraculous win was none other than Case Keenum. Facing a tough third and 10 situation, he pulled off a jaw-dropping 61-yard pass to Stefan Diggs. Diggs caught the ball unbelievably and sprinted down the sideline, scoring a last-second touchdown as the clock expired. This Minneapolis miracle instantly went down in history as the first touchdown to win an NFL playoff game in the final second. Crazy, right? But wait till you hear about the next one. Here we're talking about a match between the Green Bay Packers and Seattle Seahawks in 2012. The game depended on a nail-biting final play. With a few seconds remaining and the score tied at 14, Seahawks' Russell Wilson threw a last-ditch pass to receiver Golden Tate, leading to a chaotic tussle in the end zone between Tate and Packers defender Michael Deshaun Jennings. Jennings initially ruled a Seahawks touchdown, but the call was controversially changed to a Green Bay touchback, causing chaos on the field. The replacement officials, inexperienced due to a referee lockout, reversed the call, awarding the Seahawks a touchdown based on simultaneous possession. Dubbed the Fail Mary, this contentious ruling ignited national debate, highlighting concerns about flawed officiating in the NFL. Now, before you ponder how something could top this, let's stick to this fifth one, which is a bit older. 
in the legendary snowplow game of 1982. A defensive showdown between the New England Patriots and the Miami Dolphins was deadlocked in a scoreless tie until the fourth quarter. As the snow-covered field stifled both teams' offenses, tension mounted in the quest for a breakthrough. With minutes ticking away, Patriots coach Ron Meyer made a historic decision, signaling Mark Henderson, a convicted burglar on a work-release program and the stadium snowplow driver, onto the field. Henderson diligently cleared a spot on the snow-laden field specifically for Patriots kicker John Smith, sparking immediate protests from Dolphins coach Don Shula, who decreed the move as an unfair advantage. Well, this controversy of Smith seized the moment, nailing a 33-yard field goal and securing a 3-0 victory for the Patriots. Celebrations erupted in New England while the Dolphins and their fans seethed in frustration. Well, they should be. Coming to the fourth insane moment on our list, we're diving into the 2011 playoffs of Seattle Seahawks' Marshawn Lynch, known as Beast Mode for his sheer power. He received a handoff on second and 10 from quarterback Matt Hasselbeck. What followed was a legendary chain of events. With each evaded defender, the crowd at Quest Field erupted, generating a deafening roar that seemed to reverberate through the stadium's foundations. Fueled by the crowd's energy, Lynch charged forward, weaving and powering through the Saints' defense in an extraordinary 67-yard touchdown run. As Lynch crossed the goal line, the stadium exploded in jubilation, and the fans' synchronized excitement registered a tremor on nearby seismographs. Another craziest moment happened during a Thanksgiving Day showdown against the New England Patriots in 2012. The New York Jets, led by quarterback Mark Sanchez, initially held a promising 2010 lead. Yet as fate would have it, in a wild twist, the game spiraled into an embarrassing moment that would go down in NFL history. In a third and 10 situation on their own 29-yard line, under pressure, Sanchez inexplicably ran into his own lineman, Brandon Moore. What followed was a surreal collision that defied logic. Sanchez's attempt to tuck the ball into Moore's backside led to a catastrophic impact, dislodging the ball and gifting it to the Patriots' Steve Gregory for an effortless touchdown. The MetLife Stadium, filled with over 79,000 fans, initially fell silent before erupting in a chorus of disbelief and boos. The butt fumble transcended mere sporting mishaps. It became an internet sensation, generating countless memes and jokes. This second moment on the list is really unimaginable when, in one of the games during the 2021 NFL season, things got really wild between the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and the New York Jets. There's this guy, Antonio Brown, playing for the Bucs, who, in the third quarter, Brown decided to make a statement. He takes off his jersey and pads in the middle of a play. Can you believe it? He's standing there bare-chested, showing off, and then just bolts off the field. He started running and threw up a peace sign, totally left teammates, coaches, and fans confused and scratching their heads. After this happened, Coach Bruce Arians kicked them off the team. Plus, they fined Brown for being unsportsmanlike. Now, why'd Brown do it? That's the million-dollar question, but still unanswered. So here's the number one moment of NFL insanity on our list that you must have been waiting for, and believe us, it's worth the wait. It happened during the 2003-2004 playoffs, a face-off between Seattle and Green Bay at Lambeau Field. Both teams locked at 10-6. After a tie at 27 points each, Seattle's Sean Alexander leveled the playing field with a brilliant touchdown, but what came next was truly bewildering. Matt Hasselback, the Seahawks' captain, wins the coin toss and confidently declares, we want the ball and we're going to score. Bold words, no doubt. However, fate had other plans. In an unexpected turn of events, on Seattle's first possession in overtime, Hasselback throws an interception to Green Bay's Al Harris. What followed left mouths agape. The defender dashed 52 yards for a game-winning touchdown. Yup, 52. The NFL isn't just a game, it's an emotional journey of three hours, where moments leave us laughing, shouting, and sometimes in utter disbelief. Well, do share with us which one was the most surprising for you. And remember these 10 insane moments discussed above are just the tip of the iceberg. There's a lot more that hasn't been captured or discussed.